hey guys welcome back to my channel so i am going to be cleaning my <laughs> fridge it's like really really bad i'll show it to you guys in a bit but tomorrow i have to go grocery shopping so i really need to clean my fridge because i know there's a lot of things that are expired in there and i've been trying to clean it for a while but i just been i've been like kind of sick and lazy and tired daily so to since I, I i'm desperately in need of getting some groceries tomorrow i'm definitely gonna go ahead and clean out the fridge right now also too like we got our peloton which i will show you guys my video on that soon we love it so much so i've been trying to get on a schedule with that not that ha that has anything to do with cleaning my fridge but like <laughs> I'm having a hard time because I am so out of shape that it like I couldn't even go through a beginner's class like it was so hard I don't know how people do it and it's crazy like I accidentally went into like a hardcore <laughs> class I was like oh like people really do that but I'll get there one day so yeah today I'm just gonna be doing my fridge and I'll see you guys in a bit I'm also watching the finale. I look crazy because, like I said, I just did work out today and I dyed my hair myself. The things I said I wasn't going to do and I think it turned out orangey. But it's okay. I'm not worried about it. I'm just going to leave it. Um, But I know I looked a little crazy today. But I'm also watching the um, Housewives of Potomac. It's like the season finale. So I'm excited about that. So I'm going to be doing that while I do... Lord, you have this. So, yeah, I'm just gonna take everything out, clean it, and then just get rid of stuff as I go. Again, sorry for my hair, I know it probably looks horrible. I'm really sad about it. <clears throat> I never even opened this and look how nasty it looks. But it says it's not expired. This is good. I don't know if you guys have had it. This is an expired, but this is like so good. It's from Panera Bread brand. It's the balsamic thick grit. And then I don't know why I have chocolate. She's like one pickle in here. See what I'm talking about? It's like crazy. And my bag's ready because I got a lot of stuff. I don't know why I let my fridge get like that. I'm embarrassed to even do this video because it was like <laughs> so bad. But I'm gonna get better. So I'm gonna do a list. This time I usually just go and I see everything and then just take everything out. But today I'm gonna do a list for tomorrow. So I'm just excited about that. See how that maybe I'll spend less money because we spend so much money on this. Inflation is going on, but we put a lot of money on groceries, guys. It's like ridiculous. So, hi guys, I'm back. So happy. I think it's Tuesday. I just got back from grocery shopping, but I kind of have a mess here at the house. I just wanted to show you guys what the outcome of my <laughs> fridge looks like right now because we totally cleaned it out. Well, that's from Cheddar's yesterday, so it's just a salad I need to. Clean out so you can see it's pretty empty. <coughs> like right now, a lot cleaner than it was. But I'm about to start getting my groceries out. It was Costco's and sorry, my pantry's open because I leave it open so I can start putting stuff in. It was Costco's and Albertsons. Here in El Paso, we have Albertsons or we have, we know, we have Walmart and stuff like that. But I like Albertsons because I like their produce better. And so yeah, but, excuse my hair, I haven't been feeling my best, like I've been feeling really sick, I don't know if I'm like, I know I'm anemic, so I've really started taking iron again, but I have a doctor's appointment soon, so yeah.
my like <laughs> grocery days are not cutesy they're not like sexy and fun and mellow like you see in other channels because my grocery days are rough it's a hectic day for me um you know i have a lot of kids and stuff so and it's just me and i'm not making excuses but i just bring everything out and then i just put it away you know what i mean but i just wanted to show you guys what i do buy i'm not going to show you everything because everything's going to be kind of boring of course it's stuff that you guys already probably buy i'll just find you like the finds that i love from like albertson's and costco's that i you know that i, th I think are good in case you guys are interested but just to let you know it's not gonna be a perky little <laughs> cute you know grocery day plus my house is a mess so i am gonna clean today i've been a little sick lately um I don't know what's wrong with me. Every time, like, I have my period now, I think I'm going through menopause soon because every time I have my period, I'm, like, dying. So this is, like, the stuff from Albertsons, but it's all mixed together. I got some salmon from Costco's. I'll show you guys the good finds that I found at Costco's and what was, like, you know, a good price and stuff. But, yeah, this is all my kitchen. This is what it looks like on grocery day. And granted i knew i was gonna go to both stores by myself today so honestly i didn't even buy like the toilet paper and like all that stuff the you know necessities yet so i might have to go back for that but first find from costco's are these chips i had never tried them before i was like so hungry i like ate in the morning I'm really, really trying to lose weight. I don't know if I told you guys, but if you guys don't watch my channel like that, <clears throat> I know my channel's growing, so you might not watch this video, but not the next one, so I'll just tell you real quick. I'm really trying to lose weight. So um, I hit 43 on January 3rd, and I feel good, but um, I've been like, I gained a lot of weight. Like, I'm like at 160. I lost five pounds. I lost a little bit more than that because we got a peloton which i have a video for you guys coming up i'm almost done with it i just really wanted to try it out and get the full effect before i really like show you guys but these chips are so good they're like spicy i love spicy stuff so if you don't like spicy stuff just um probably don't buy these but they're they're not like crazy spicy i ever since let me close this for any wonder Ever since I got older, I haven't, like, I used to be able to eat the spiciest stuff in the world. And now I'm, like, getting a little bit, like, away from that. I don't know why. I don't know why I can't handle it as much. But these are good. So good for a little snack. I can't have too many of these. I just wanted to taste them because I was, like, hungry. But they're 140 calories for 15 chips is <coughs> one serving. So yeah, <clears throat> I need to stop that. But they're so good though. So if you guys see them and you guys like, you know, spicy jalapenos, very, very good. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, I've been really trying. I got back on Weight Watchers and I haven't really been active on it. I'm gonna start being active after today because I got my groceries. I only go to Costco's once a month, but I do go to, you know, fill in the blanks or fill in the days to albertons like after that i used to go to whole foods and i love going to whole foods the only thing it would take me literally all day because there's so much traffic in el paso now for some reason and whole foods is way on the other side of town it literally like we moved further so it takes me like a good hour to get to whole foods and that's on a good day. It's been crazy with traffic and construction. So I was like, I'm not going to go to Whole Foods. And I only buy like a little bit of things. So there's not like I buy, you know, all this crazy stuff. I usually buy my husband's meal preps there because it's so much easier and they're good. But I'm going to start doing the meal preps. And guess what? I got these Glade um, meal prep thingies. I have already had them 
um, before, but these are so easy. I don't know why I just bought one pack. I should have got two, but for 50 pieces, which is, you know, of course, 25 and 25, uh, the tops and the bottoms, uh, it is $7.99. They're amazing. This is the only thing that I did buy non-food, but you gotta try, like, if you do your meal preps, these are amazing, and they're even good for, like, you know, to uh, Tupperware, because they're so cheap. And then, of course, I bought these nasty cookies. I hate these cookies, but my kids love them. So, since it's almost Valentine's, I got those for them. Uh, like I said, I wanted to show you, like, you know, the rest is like veggies and all that. But this I haven't tried. Um, so I saw it. It's called Chicken Katsu Season and Bray Slice Chicken Breast with Rip Meat and Panko breading so i look for like fast things to make for myself during the day that you know i could just have like one slice of this and then like you know veggies and stuff that i can make for myself real quick and then i get my kids you know i make them a real meal and then these are all just veggies and jalapenos and stuff like that and tomatoes but I got some fruit. It looks pretty good. Albertsons usually has really good fruit, but they've been slacking lately. So I also got these. So everything I'm showing you guys that I haven't tried, I'll try it for you guys when I make it. I'll try it on camera. And I will tell you guys if I like it or not because there's some things that I'm just like, why did I buy this? But there's some things that you buy and I'm like, oh my God, why hadn't I bought this before? Like the chicken cordon blue from there. I didn't get it this time because I'm going to try this chicken so katsu, however you say it but the chicken corn on blue from um costco's is delicious you just put it in your air fryer you bake it and then you, you air crisp it for a bit and it's like to perfection i'm gonna try these i really never try mexican food on a box but i'm gonna try it they're enchiladas um we're gonna have a little party on you know um not a party it's just us but like a little um barbecue for super bowl so i don't watch the, the super bowl but my husband does so i was like gonna make little snacks with these and i love these crackers so these are pretty good um and look how cute these macaroons i don't really like macaroons but these are no you know i do like macaroons i'm like i don't i didn't like the ones that were kind of like, uh, I think they were like lavender or something like that. Those are the ones I didn't like. But uh, these are good. I mean, these look good. And they, I just thought they were so cute. So I should have got like three of these, one for each teacher for my kids. But that would have been a cute Christmas. I mean, Valentine's gift. So I got ginger. I mean, like I told you guys, I used to, like, I got lost a lot of weight. That's why I'm so upset. Like, I was literally down to 145. I was doing good. I still needed to lose weight, but I was doing so good. Um, I was doing, like, ginger shots in the mornings, or I would put ginger on my green um, drinks and stuff like that. And then I just gave up. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> we moved out of that house to my mom's house, and it was just like... I got a little depressed and then I just gave up on, you know, taking care of myself and stuff. So I got to get back. So I did buy ginger for that. Ginger is like expensive, but it was like $8 for this whole box. So, yeah. and then I also going to try this with salad and let's see how it is. This is organic broccoli cheddar stuffed chicken breast. So with rice pilaf, let's see how good it is. It contains two pouches per um, thing. It's 210 per serving, 210 calories per serving. So I just thought this was good and then get like some, a salad or, you know, just some, um, what's it called? Veggies. I thought it was good. I also got these. I always get these. These are the stuffed, um, bell peppers they're delicious from costco's they are a little pricey they're 24 bucks but it, i'm letting you know it's worth it my husband loves them i i make them myself sometimes but i'm not gonna lie those are like way better and then i got this uh vinaigrette marinade uh what's it called lemon uh this is good from panera bread 
Uh, I got that at um, Albertsons. And then there's my meat, just ground beef. Stuff like that. I buy this for, um, I don't know why I'm stuffy. I buy this from for avocado bread, so I bought some avocados. And this is good too from Costco's. Now I have had this, this is delicious. So easy to make. I definitely recommend these pastas. They're like in the aisle where like the cheese and everything is, but if you see these, definitely try them out. They're so good and so easy. I also got some tortilla crusted tilapia. Again, you know, easy meal when I'm by myself, so I don't have to cook all this food by myself. I haven't tried that, so when I do try it, I'll let you guys know if it's good, and I'll show it to you guys. So I also got this. I don't know if you had this, but these are like little packages of fried rice. So they're easy. My kids love them. I try to buy easy stuff, you know. And then I've had this before. I bake it with this. This is actually really good. It almost tastes like orange chicken, but a little bit like more crispier. It's so good. So this is the Korean style crunchy chicken with sweet and spicy sauce. So good with that rice. Easy, fast, beautiful meal. And then, you know, these are my veggies for the size of either the chicken, the tilapia, everything I showed you guys. I'm putting this on the floor because this goes in the other fridge because this fridge is nothing like that's gonna fit there. So these are egg whites. These are so easy to make. My husband only, my daughter, they only like egg whites. So that's what they get. These are super easy pizzas. I mean, they're, you can't go wrong with these. You know, when the kids are hungry, Pop them in the oven for 15 minutes at 350 and a side of fruit or carrots, whatever. Super easy meal. Uh, I got prunes, not prunes. What are these? Date, double date, dates, I guess. I don't know. Uh, they're stuff for my mom. They're gross. But in case you're interested, I got something they have on my tacos. I got these are so fun and easy. So I got two of these. I only got two. I got this a lot the other day. And to be honest with you, I'm the only one that eats them. So one lasts me two days or two servings. So I, I'm going to try the Asian one. This one I tried. It's so good. Crispy Tyson chicken. But this is so good. Um, you know, I put this in the air fryer. I bake it for 10, minute, 10 minutes and then I crisp it for like three and it comes out so crispy and delicious. You gotta get this, I got this at Costco's and I also got this, this is pretty good. You know, for I love chicken sandwiches for a quick chicken sandwich and you just put it in the air fryer and with the lettuce and a little bit of mayo. I'm not a big mayo fan, but I do like it on my chicken sandwiches. It kind of reminds me of the Wendy's chicken sandwich. So good. And I got these bagel chips. These are so good. Yeah. So I'm only going to get a little bit. They're actually for my mom. So I'm going to steal some from her because then I will eat those. And then I got some cookies for the kids. I know I, I forgot I had got those cookies. And then I went and got the other cookies. And But you see how like I'm getting huge and I'm feeling a difference. I'm on my period now. So I get extra big but still it's just like i've been feeling off um i'm trying to show you the good finds from costco these are awesome i get these for the kids for their little snacks lunch snacks i got some cauliflower because i'm going to try to eat a lot of cauliflower <laughs> um you know and these are delicious. Oh my God, I'm, I'm not a sweets person, but I'm, I can't be going to like the grocery store when I'm on my period because when I'm off my period, I hate sweets. Like I won't eat them and then they all stay there. But then I buy the dumbest sweets, not the dumbest sweets, but the sweets the kids or nobody likes. And then they just like go stale, but I buy like a lot of them because I'm like craving them that time. And then I'm just like, they all stay there because nobody likes my sweets that I buy. They like like real, real sweet stuff. But these are good. They just have a lot of calories. But um, 
uh, I'm just gonna eat like a couple and have a sweet tooth. I could only eat one. Like I don't know, I don't know if you guys know what that means, but every time I eat anything sweet, I could only eat like two bites and then it's like, oh, it's a lot, you know what I mean? I got these for my dad. He loves these, they're macadamia um, chocolate. They're really good, I got those. Those are from Costco's. And then I got just some chicken breast. I've had this, this is really good. And I will show you guys like when I make this, because again, just real quick meal with some veggies and a little rice, a side of rice or, you know, or even like I have a chicken Alfredo from Costco's last time. I never made it. Um, but I've had it before and it's so good. So it's this Raul's, I hope I'm saying it right, homemade Alfredo. So that with the chicken and you know, spaghetti on your cheat days are so delicious. My battery's gonna die, I'll be back. I'm back. So I try to pray over our food every time we get it because I was so blessed everything that's going on to be able to if, able to be able to, <laughs> to be able to afford food and to you know have a roof over our head and just stuff like that it's just a blessing like you know just trying to be really thankful for everything and just learn how to be thankful and just whatever it is just say 10 things you're thankful for you know <clears throat> because you know we don't want to take it for granted and the more we're thankful i feel the more you attract you know more things to be thankful for so just you know get a chance take a break and just say thank you to god or whatever you guys believe in and you know that way you guys could get more so yes that's what i've been doing every time you know I go, I go overboard though. I like pick this up and I'm like, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You know what I mean? But you do it however you want to. But, anyways, I'm gonna start putting stuff away. And if I find anything else that I missed, I will show it to you guys because I still have all that. Um, Alberts and stuff. Oh, I did get the kids' kids. It's because I do make their lunch. I do make their lunch because sometimes they, you know. Their stomachs are weird, sometimes they're lactose, sometimes they're not. It's just weird, but anyways, I got them Lunchables. My daughter likes to take her little Lunchable every day, and then I got them some chips that they take on Fridays. I usually try to put them like fruit and stuff in there in their lunch, so it's not all like crazy, but I also got these. They love these, they love, I like these, but I only like the blueberry ones, but they like the chocolate chip ones so i got these from costco's i forgot all the prices i do know that i spent 200 dollars more than i usually spend and i didn't get that much crazy extra things so my total for costco's was 774 dollars and for <clears throat> albertson's was almost 300 dollars i'll give you guys exact amounts and stuff but yeah, I was like, whoa, it came out a little bit more expensive than usual. That's why it's important to, you know, be thankful and <clears throat> stuff like that because it's changing out there. I didn't think of, I knew inflation was there, but that it was an extreme amount that I'm used to, you know, spending. I usually spend $500 at Costco's. It was like 200 and something out extra. So FYI, but I'll see you guys soon. Thank you.